park just north of Highland Lakes Elementary School in Deer Valley Unified School District celebrating walk and bike to school day. We have lots of kids gathered at the park ready to walk in, reduce traffic, reduce pollution, increase a safe environment for our kids. We have lots of characters here that are going to get us here safely. Before we get started, I want to introduce a very special guest we have joining us today. We have the Coyote Howler. He's going to be walking with us today as we exit the park and walk up to the school. Join us as we go on our walk for Walk and Bike today. I'm going to be stopping traffic for you. Even with me stopping traffic, you still have to look yourself. Okay, does everybody understand that? Yeah. yeah. no doubt they pulled all the stops out at this school. Uh, I, I, think, I think they said excess of 1,200 students, if I'm not mistaken, and I think all of them plus were here, uh, a lot of parents. I mean, it's just a really neat event. Got a little bit of rain this morning, which made it kind of fun. To walk or bike from the park all the way here together. It was a lot of fun, and like, because everyone was walking over in a group. I thought it was a lot of fun to get with my friends and ride my bike to school. It was really cool to have everyone there. We had a terrific turnout. I have two kids that go to Highland Lakes and both participated um, and my husband took the day off and my son and I, all, we all rode our bikes over today. So it was a lot of fun. It was awesome. We had a huge turnout, showed the kids how to get to school safely and made sure that it also highlighted on how it's better to walk and ride than it is to drive. It helps the environment because it stops pollution. This isn't going to fit on my head. I hear the judging is complete. Let's go on in and check in with the mayor and Councilmember Martinez and see what they felt about what the kids brought to school. Well, they're helmets and, and they're promoting safety with kids riding their bikes and, and they, they just encourage the kids to decorate their hats with no rules, whatever the kids were comfortable doing. And you can tell by looking at these, uh, uh, first place was the airplane. Uh, you know, he went so far as putting the wings on in a proper direction. I mean, he, you know, he, he got it right, so that, that tells you a lot. Uh, just the arch artistry that's, that's been put into this one, the second place. Uh, there's no doubt in my mind that, that uh, she's probably going to end up being a florist or a designer. And even this third one, I mean, there's, there's just a lot of different things going on here. But, uh, you know, the kids have got great imaginations, and I think they've done a marvelous job. Uh, to see all the kids coming through and, you know, with it's just, it's a great experience. It's, it's really refreshing. The event went super. Thank you for joining us on Walk and Bike Day here at Highland Lakes in Deer Valley Unified School District. We're standing with a few of our friends that helped us attend this program and make it successful. We've got the Mountain Ridge mascots. We've got superheroes. We've got Howler. <laughs> Fantastic. We had police. We have Mayor Wires. We have Councilmember Martinez. We thank you so much for coming, walking to school, reducing traffic, reducing pollution, keeping our school safer by reducing those four wheels that travel towards our school. Thank you so much. Woo!